Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We are doing two boxes of Star Wars Evolution for Curtis. The last two boxes of the case, so unfortunately this, this uh, galactic adventure has started to come to a close. Uh, what does he need left? So he's trying to make, he's trying to build all sorts of sets for this. So we're we're helping the cause. We usually don't do personal boxes, but we we, we did this for Curtis because ages ago we did, and he bought one, and now he's trying to make this big set. So et cetera, et cetera. So we're helping him out. He still needs a lot of autos, more purples and golds, and the Vader lenticular. Got it. Okay, and he has all the short. Okay. All right. So the box that we have left is uh, actually. They're pretty related. It's the, that's the back of an X-Wing, and that is a TIE Fighter. So we are helping the cause, and it's been a good cause. Thankfully, we've been able to uh, we've been a we've been able to add to Curtis's collection. So that makes me feel good about this whole process. Uh, Curtis saying all Anakin base and blue goes to Oh, no, 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 Curtis. You can keep all the Anakin Skywalkers. I know that he is your favorite character, especially in the prequels. So, I mean, by all means, I, I, would, I do not want to deny you any of that. Oh, wow. Les says uh, he has two boxes of Star Wars Finest. From 1998. What kind of wonders could be in there? Curtis wants you, Calgary Curtis wants you to crack it, Les. All right, good luck, Curtis. Let's see what we got out of here. Oh, let's hide the autograph. And there's a purple. I don't know if you have this one or not. Mace Windu, purple. With the purple lightsaber, of course. Specially made for him. And Alan Harris as Bosk. Nice auto. And looks like a gold. You need some gold, right? Padme. 34 out of 50. And Admiral Akbar. It's a trap. And then them. Curtis, I've been listening to yet another Star Wars book on tape, another audio book, not on tape, but an audio book, <laughs> book on tape. Uh, yeah, I've been listening to a book on tape, Obi-Wan, Obi-Wan Kenobi. Now that is a name I've not heard in a long time, long time. Uh, and I'm listening to the uh, the Darth Plagueis book, which is pretty good, actually, pretty darn good, I have to say. Darth Plagueis the Wise, and so there's a lot of uh, a lot of Palpatine stuff there. How they met, how they uh, oh, this is pretty cool. How they met. How he got turned. There's some early or some early Dooku. 
uh, stuff. There's early early Padme stuff where she became like a, a local senator representative, that kind of thing. BB-8, resistance flag. 18 out of 1. So yeah, I don't think it's... I think pretty much 90% of this stuff is not canon, right? Yeah, sure, Joe P. Oh, it talks about how how he how uh, Palpatine found him briefly. So there's a lot of like there's a lot of interesting stuff that's there. I don't think it's canon though. I'm pretty sure like aren't like ninety million percent of things are like ninety ninety percent of the books aren't like in canon. All right, so that was box number one. Joe P saying that he sent me an email and wants me to know what I think. I'm going to check after this break, but my only speculation is that it's about Joe P's visit to California to visit Jaspies, which is delightful. He's from Arizona. And I'm hoping that he's just like, hey, uh, so we're going to take you out to Ruth's Chris Steakhouse. How many steaks do you want is what he's asking. I'm pretty sure that's what he's about to ask. How many steaks do you want? You know, I'd be like, yeah, just a delicious, delicious butterfly cut steak from Ruth's Chris Steakhouse or go to Lowry's Beverly Hills, Joe P go all the way out there. That'd be nice. Could take us there. Chart house. There's a chart house seafood place right around the corner. We've got pretty good food there. All right, there you go, Curtis. And your next box. Yeah, steak with some ketchup. Right, exactly. Can you imagine? Go to Ruth's Chris or some other fancy steakhouse and then be like, yeah, I'd like some ketchup. I believe like head chef would run out and just be like, you SOB, you get out of my restaurant right now. And then I'd say, I'm Joe, and I'd be like, I'm Joe Jaspi. Do you know, don't you know who I am? I'll do that. Don't you know who I am? I'm Jaspi, Joe Jaspi. <laughs> the, the host of a, uh, the host of an online internet channel with like 2000 subscribers. Don't you know, don't you know who I am? That's what I'll have to say. I'm the guy that uh, I'm the guy that opens up like uh, I'm the guy that opens up uh, you know Star Wars cards. Don't you know who I am? Yeah, I'm internet famous. Bring me my ketchup, peasant, is what I'd say. Oh, Josh York is too good for. Are you saying you're too good for Bruce Chris? Bruce Chris is still pretty good. Morton's is good too. Uh, at the national a couple years ago, uh, at the national a couple years ago, we went to a place called Gibson's right across the street from the convention center. That is a pretty good steakhouse as well. Yeah, Kyle, I, th I think that was his. <laughs> I think that was his point. Curtis was trying to rile people up. Just bring your, bring your own McDonald's ketchup packets to the steakhouse. What was your reaction, Kevin, when someone busted out the ketchup, asked for the ketchup at the Mortons? All right, here we go. Second box, Curtis needs purples. Do you have this one? Purple Darth Vader? I don't know if you have, if you have that one yet, but want to try to keep holding it, helping him build his set. Stop. You can buy McDonald's ketchup by the bottle. And that's the first time I've heard of that. That's amazing.
Oh, there we go. So we can add some purple Vader to his collection. Excellent. What about John Boyega as Finn? Purple. Do you have this one? Huh, Curtis? 15 out of 25. Boom. Nice John Boyega. I've heard of him. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. And a gold Anakin Skywalker. You said I could have all the Anakins, right? Pretty sure you said I could have all the Anakins. 49 out of 50 gold for Curtis. More. Wow, what a box. Princess Leia purple. So you got Vader, Leia, and Anakin Skywalker gold. The Anakin, yeah, 49 out of 50 on the Anakin too. And the Resistance, the Ednum Resistance flag. 6 out of 25. Nice low number there. What a box. Do you, oh, you said you said you need the Vader lenticular, right? But you got the Princess Leia lenticular. This is this is the X Wing box too, Curtis. We saved the X Wing box for last. It's pretty good. <laughs> I hate you. So angry. Anger management issues for that one. This effing kid kills me. Like, what a what a terrible casting choice. Are you an angel? <laughs> God. Anyway, what a great box for you, especially this, Curtis. So, well, that's it. I wish we had more evolution boxes, but but we don't. So that's the end of that adventure. However, we ended strong with a John Boyega on-card autograph, 15 out of 25, a parallel as well. So thank you very much, Curtis. I think we made it worth your while. Thanks for making it worth our while. We appreciate it. Um, that's it, everybody. Star Wars in the books. Thanks, Curtis. Bye.